Hello and welcome to this video regarding Ableton Live and ASIO Link Pro. We're going to get started by going to our preferences because we're going to do the setup here real quick. Now make sure to set your driver type to ASIO audio device. You're going to set that to ASIO Link Pro. Automatically the window pops up and we have just the bare minimum setup initially. So I'm going to show you a little bit more about how to do additional setup on this, which should apply to any other DAW that you do use. For ASIO Link Pro, channel configuration, channel input. Depending on how many inputs you have, set them up accordingly. For me, this is appropriate for my current setup as far as inputs are concerned. And now that populates. Now. We also have to set up our stereo outputs. You don't exactly need your mono outputs, so we're going to stick with stereo. For the safety of things, I choose to have 1 and 2 through 7 and 8. The window will pop up again once you click OK, and we'll have additional outputs per our virtualization. We can close the window. Everything is set up as it should be. And now with my OBS Studio window, I'm going to switch my drivers and show you exactly what's happening here. That's with my 18i20 only allowed. With this, however, is that you need to set an input to two outputs. And this itself will allow you to be able to hear what's going on as the signal chain flows in ASIO Link Pro. Now, in order to route Ableton Live into Discord, so we need to join Discord first. And the next step is, once you have all of your Azure Link Pro routing stuff handled, where your mute button is at, and this is a fun little trick if you haven't discovered it before, or if you've seen it in my previous video regarding Reaper to Discord, you right-click the mute button, and you get all of this stuff popped up. Mix01 is our current stereo main output from Azure Link Pro, so let's select that. And I can still talk here. However, I'm also now able to input Nexus 2 from Ableton Live in the Discord. Check this out. And then if you want to go back to your main interface input, you'll check your list here. Go from mix01 to your main interface for me, 18i20. And I've also renamed it through Windows 10. And then we are back to our 18i20 interface and And that should help you out in Azure Link Pro routing Ableton Live into Discord. If the video was helpful, please consider giving it a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell.